fold my material into two I'm going to measure the half length half length is 8 inches I add 1 inch to for sewing giving me 9 inches I mark shoulder is 4 inches plus half inch to sew armhole 5 inches bust is 20 inches 20 divided by 4 will give me 5 inches I add 1 inch to sew the same with the waist 20 inches divided by 4 5 inches plus 1 inch to sew remember I'm sewing for two months old baby one to four months can wear this neckline is two inches and I cut so I'm going to cut the front I just finished cutting the back fold my material into two and place the one I just finished cutting on top and I cut so the front neck I place my tape on the shoulder and measure down two and a half inches So I'm going to cut the lining. I'm going to place the material I just finished cutting on top the lining and cut exactly the same way I cut the back and the front. Like this. The front lining, then place the front on top in cuts so I'm going to cut the down that is the flare I fold my material into two and I fold again this is into four eight inches so I remove eight inches from the flare that I'm going to cut now then before I start cutting So this is 12 inches plus 1 inch to sew. So I place my tape on the tip like this. Then I measure from the tip here. Down. I'm going to continue like this. 8 and a half inches. Then I mark. After doing that, then I'm going to measure the length. Length is 12 inches. Then I add 1 inch to sew. I'm going to measure 13 inches. Just like this. Then after doing that, I will mark before I cut. So after I finish cutting, I'm going to open one side where I'm going to sew zip on. I'm going to cut one side like this. I notch the center and the side and where I'm going to sew zip on.
this is the net I'm going to sew under plus lining the net and the lining they are the same measurement 10 inches This is the bet I'm going to use to tie on the back. And you can cut any length you want. Then I bring the right side out. So after doing all that, I'm going to start to sew. Of the neck and the ham so the lining doesn't show on the ham so I use the same material to cut lining the back and the front so when I sew the lining will not show yet the material will show inside instead so I'm going to start to sew and direct you now to sew it so I finish sewing the neck this is the neckline. I sew the neck. I'm going to bring out the right side. I sew the neck, the ham hole, and the side of the top. Because I'm not going to overlock. But if you have overlock, you don't have to do it the way I did. By sewing the side of, of the top. So I bring out the right side. I will iron. So this is the back, this is the front, so the lining is in the middle, so I iron. So I sew one side of the shoulder, So I'm going to sew the other shoulder. This part is very tricky for beginners. Please pay attention on the way I sew the shoulder. So I bring the wrong side out. I'm going to place the back of the shoulder inside the right side of the... So as you can see, I place the shoulder inside in between the lining and the main material of the front that is the back of the top so before I sew I will sew the bed on it before joining so I finished sewing the shoulder and the belt. I'm going to join the two sides. So I'm going to prepare the down parts. I'm going to sew the net and the main material together. I'm going to add, you can add plant or you can draw gather. So I finished sewing the two sides. I'm going to sew the flared and the top together. The measurement of the waist is 20 inches. So we are going to fix zip on, on the back of the flag. So if you want to add plants, you can do that. If you want gather, you can also do that. So this is it. I finished sewing the flared and the top together so i'm going to sew the lining 
that is inside to cover up the rough edge this is the way I'm going to place the lining this is how I'm going to sew it then after sewing it like this I will drop it then the rough edge will be covered so I don't need to overlock the side so after doing that I will so zip on it then that will be the finished look if you like this video please give it a thumbs up as always share if you are new please subscribe and if you have any question concerning this video or any of my video please leave in the comment below thank you so much please share to friends and families and i will see you in my next one bye bye